Our everyday experience is confined to three dimensions of space and one of time. We navigate through our lives perceiving the world in terms of length, width, and height, and we are acutely aware of the passage of time as it flows from the past, through the present, and into the future. We perceive height, width, and depth which form the basis of our spatial understanding. These three dimensions allow us to measure and interact with the physical world around us, from the smallest objects to the vast expanse of the universe, along with the passage of time. Time, the fourth dimension, is an ever-present backdrop to our existence marking the sequence of events and the progression of our lives. However, the realm of theoretical physics challenges us to expand our conceptual framework beyond these familiar dimensions. It invites us to consider the possibility that our universe is far more complex and multifaceted than our senses can perceive. Quantum mechanics, the study of the very small, suggests the existence of additional dimensions beyond our perception. These dimensions could be compactified or hidden in ways that make them imperceptible to our everyday experiences. String theory, a prominent framework attempting to unify quantum mechanics and general relativity, posits that the universe exists in ten spatial dimensions and one temporal dimension. These extra dimensions could hold the key to understanding the fundamental forces of nature and the true nature of reality. Exploring the structure of atoms across these dimensions offers a fascinating glimpse into the fundamental nature of reality. By delving into these hidden dimensions, scientists hope to uncover the mysteries of the universe, from the behavior of subatomic particles to the grand structure of the cosmos itself. The journey beyond the perceptible dimensions is not just a scientific endeavor, but a profound quest to understand the very fabric of existence. In a one-dimensional world, the atom, the fundamental building block of matter, would be reduced to a single point. Lacking any spatial extent, it would exist solely as a location on a line. This point-like atom would possess properties like mass and charge, but its ability to interact with other particles would be severely limited by the constraints of a one-dimensional universe. The mathematical description of such a system would be relatively simple, but it fails to capture the complexity of the atoms we observe in our universe. Adding a second dimension transforms the point-like atom into a flat disk. This disk, confined to a two-dimensional plane, can now move in two independent directions. The atom's interactions with other particles become more intricate, governed by forces acting within the plane. Mathematically, the atom's behavior in two dimensions can be represented using planar geometry and two-dimensional vectors. While still a simplification, this model offers a stepping stone towards understanding atoms in higher dimensions. The familiar three-dimensional world allows the atom to take on a more recognizable form. No longer confined to a plane, it now exists as a sphere, free to move in three independent directions, height, width, and depth. The atom's interactions with other particles become even more complex, with forces acting in all three spatial dimensions. The mathematical description of atoms in three dimensions requires the tools of three-dimensional geometry and vector calculus, providing a more accurate representation of the atoms we observe in our universe. Introducing a fourth dimension, time, adds a new layer of complexity to our understanding of the atom. No longer static, the atom now exists as a hypersphere, a three-dimensional sphere evolving through time. Its position, momentum and energy fluctuate over time, influenced by interactions with other particles and fields. Mathematically, this dynamic behavior can be described using the framework of quantum field theory, which treats particles as excitations of underlying quantum fields that permeate space-time. Venturing beyond the familiar four dimensions of space-time, we enter the realm of extra dimensions, as predicted by string theory. The fifth dimension is often described as curled up and extremely small, far beyond our ability to directly observe. In this dimension the atom would vibrate, its properties influenced by the geometry of this hidden dimension. The mathematical description of the atom in five dimensions becomes more abstract, requiring advanced mathematical tools like Kaluza-Klein theory, which explores the unification of gravity and electromagnetism in higher dimensions. As we progress to the sixth and seventh dimensions, the concept of the atom undergoes a radical transformation. 
In these higher dimensions, the familiar notion of atoms as indivisible particles is replaced by a more complex and fascinating picture. Here, atoms are not just simple building blocks but are part of a grander, more intricate structure that challenges our traditional understanding of the universe. String theory asserts that the fundamental building blocks of matter are not point-like particles but rather tiny, vibrating strings. These strings are incredibly small, far smaller than anything we can currently observe with our most advanced instruments. They vibrate at specific frequencies, and it is these vibrations that determine the properties of the particles they form. These strings vibrate at different frequencies, giving rise to the different particles we observe. Just as different musical notes are produced by the vibrations of a guitar string, different particles are the result of the various vibrational modes of these fundamental strings. This elegant idea unifies all particles and forces in a single framework. The six extra dimensions, including the sixth and seventh, are thought to be curled up into intricate geometrical shapes called calabi yau manifolds. These manifolds are incredibly complex and are essential to the mathematics of string theory. They provide the extra spatial dimensions needed for the strings to vibrate in different ways, leading to the rich variety of particles and forces we see in our universe. The atom, now envisioned as a vibrating string, interacts with other strings within the confines of these higher dimensional spaces. These interactions are not random, but follow precise mathematical rules dictated by the geometry of the calabi yau manifolds. This higher dimensional interaction is what gives rise to the fundamental forces and particles that make up our universe. The mathematical description of these interactions relies on the sophisticated framework of string theory. This framework is a blend of quantum mechanics and general relativity, two pillars of modern physics. String theory aims to unify these two theories into a single coherent picture, providing a deeper understanding of the fundamental nature of reality. The equations of string theory are complex and beautiful, offering a glimpse into the underlying order of the cosmos. The eighth dimension, like the fifth, is thought to be a spatial dimension curled up into a small, unobservable size. This means that while we cannot directly observe it with our current technology, it plays a crucial role in the fabric of our universe. The concept of these hidden dimensions is fundamental to string theory, which posits that the universe is made up of tiny, vibrating strings. However, unlike the fifth dimension, which is associated with a single type of string vibration, the eighth dimension is thought to allow for multiple types of strings to coexist. This coexistence of different string types in the eighth dimension suggests a more complex and rich structure of the universe. Each type of string vibration could correspond to different fundamental particles, giving rise to the diverse array of particles we observe in our universe. This possibility gives rise to the concept of a multiverse, where different regions of the universe could have different laws of physics, governed by different string vibrations. In this multiverse, each region could have its own unique set of physical laws, leading to a vast and diverse cosmic landscape. The idea of a multiverse challenges our understanding of reality, and opens up new possibilities for the nature of existence. The atom in this context exists as a vibrating string within a vast interconnected cosmic landscape. This perspective shifts our view of atoms from being mere building blocks of matter to dynamic entities that are part of a larger, intricate web of vibrations. Understanding atoms as vibrating strings within this cosmic framework could revolutionize our approach to physics and deepen our comprehension of the universe's underlying structure. The ninth dimension introduces an even more mind-boggling concept, connections between different universes within the multiverse. This dimension is thought to allow for wormholes, hypothetical tunnels that could connect distant points in space-time, potentially bridging different universes within the multiverse. The atom, as a vibrating string, could, in principle, traverse these wormholes, traveling between universes with different physical laws. The mathematical description of such phenomena remains largely speculative, pushing the boundaries of our current theoretical understanding. In the 10th dimension, we reach the ultimate unification of space-time. All possible points in space-time, including all possible universes within the multiverse, collapse into a single point. The atom, as a vibrating string, ceases to exist as a distinct entity, merging with the totality of existence. This point represents the ultimate beginning and end of everything, encompassing all possibilities and potentialities. 
The mathematical description of this state lies beyond the reach of our current theoretical frameworks. The 11th dimension, the final dimension in M-theory, a leading candidate for a unified theory of physics, brings us full circle. Here, strings no longer vibrate within the confines of a 10-dimensional spacetime, instead, their vibrations give rise to the very fabric of spacetime itself. The atom, as a vibrating string, plays a fundamental role in shaping the structure of the universe. The mathematical description of this intricate interplay between strings and spacetime remains a profound challenge, representing the forefront of theoretical physics research.